Hello everyone, it's me Josh and I'm here going to London with my brother! How you doing, sweet? How was, how was your piss? <laughs> Uh, we'll probably we start recording when we get to uh, the event anyway, so see you then. Right, so anyway, if you can hear our voices, we've arrived here at the convention, and my brother's looking for Walking Dead stuff. And where's, hang on, where's the Walking Dead stuff? Is it? Alright, let's go have a look. You recording? Yeah. You enjoying it? Yes. <laughs> Space Godzilla, Joe Godzilla, Kibu, Mecha Godzilla, Destroyer. Uh, I don't care what you're thinking, I'm buying what, I'm gonna get one of these. Dragon Ball stuff. Okay. Is there anything in them? No, yeah, they're all bigger in there. Something like, I actually don't know what they're Oh, it's one in the Ginyu, so. Yeah. Uh, Alright, I'll take, I'll take the seven. Okay. Alright, uh, seven. We get one in the Godzilla ones as well. Which one? Uh, Kiwi. Yeah, that's easy, yeah? I want him, though. Huh? <laughs> I still want him. Yeah, really. It's expensive, that one. How much is it? 35. Uh, what about the seven one? That's 20. Uh, they're all Japanese ones. I'll take Kiwu. Uh, no, yeah, the 2000 the reboot Godzilla. Well, this is the theatre exclusive. Still, what I want to do is that. Japan, when the yeah. movies first come out, yeah. the theatres are released really exclusive, a different coloured one. This is that. Oh, so, so that's in um, a limited edition? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'll have, I'll have him. 35, we've still got the tag as well. That's fine, yeah. I'm Waller. Waller. Oh, he found Waldo. Uh, last we met, uh, can't remember. Oh yeah, Bomber Cotton. And we bumped into people. Who is a? Hello. Hello. Busy bee. And not important. Anyway, about to try some of this uh, Japanese ice. I you enjoying yours. Can I have a taste? Because you tasted mine. Oh! Mm. Oh, that was nice. But mine's nicer. Fall <laughs> out New Vegas.
Okay, so just like I did at CamCon, I'm going to show off uh, what I got at the convention. So, so let's have a look. Uh, let's see. So, uh, we'll actually begin. Uh, let's see, where can we begin? Uh, we'll look at you in a minute. Okay, we'll look at the first thing uh, I bought. Uh, first thing I got was the, uh, the the good Walking Dead game, uh, which. Uh, this is my copy, my brother also got a copy as well, uh, we got that for about £20, so... And also, it's it's still, like, in the in its, um, plastic casing, the plastic bit, so, uh, I've yet, I've yet to unwrap it and open it, but we'll get into that soon. Um, uh, uh, oh, and, uh, seeing as I am a fan of the Fallout series, I got, um, a, uh, Keep Calm and Enjoy New Coca-Cola poster. I'm sure my mate uh, George Richter will like, and also I got an actual, an actual Coke bottle, uh, actual Coke bottle of a uh, new Coca-Cola. It's, it's, um, it's all uh, printed and that. It's all, um, it's all, it's all been, it's all been painted in that. And, uh, and I got this, yeah. So I thought, hey, why, why not get a drink as well when I'm at it? Uh, it's not the, it's not the actual new Coca-Cola, but it is. Uh, Nuka Cola uh, made um, thing, which is pretty impressive. There was a few there, but I decided just to get one as a souvenir. And, uh, and also, uh, at this, uh, actually, this was actually at, bought. At, uh, this stuff here was actually as well. Uh, the stuff I bought here was actually uh, the stuff I got was actually all at the same, the exact same um, store. So these two here, and then these two as well. They were all at the same store. And these, and actually, these are my, uh, quite, uh, two personal favorite things I bought at the convention. Uh, uh, this actually has a bit of a story, actually, because, um, when me and my brother were there, uh, going around the different stores and that, um, we, uh, I saw, well, actually, I saw a, um, a retro gaming store that had, like, um, NES cartridges, uh, N64, Sega Mega Drive, or Genesis, if you're North American, and all sorts of different um, retro games, and uh, there was uh, an NES, there was an NES, and uh, a Super Nintendo that cost about forty pounds. And I just uh, and I and I wanted to get one, but I didn't. So I thought if I so I didn't at first, and then and then when about I think about two hours later, when uh, me and my brother split up, he went to get a Walking Dead T-shirt. Uh, I said I might go and buy that NES or Super Nintendo, and sadly though they weren't there. So I saw it to us, so they weren't there, they'd been sold, sadly, and so did the Mega Drive as well, so I was kind of bummed out. But I went around the corner, and I saw there was uh, these guys, um, uh, they, were selling re they were selling PlayStation games, and the first two games that I saw were these two here. Um, Res uh, it's, uh, the Resident Evil Director's uh, Cut, in fact, actually, I actually have with me the original... Uh, the this is the original one that's been with uh, it's been with us for about God knows how long actually. Well, that's 98. And then I decided I'd uh, get the uh, director's cut. I actually own this on the uh, on PSN, but I now have a f that, but that's a digital download. But I, now I've got a I've got a physical copy of it. And then uh, probably the best, and then the best Resident Evil game of all time, Resident Evil 2. That was well. My dad did actually have that originally, but then uh, I think he gave it back to his friend or something. And then uh, yeah, but he had. But now that I actually own a copy of it, we will be having fun with that. And uh, I got this. Uh, I bought this off my friend uh, Steph, uh, which is a it's a kite, it's a Mako doll. A, Ma a Mako, sorry, a Mako miniature figurine, uh, which she was selling for about two pounds, and I thought I might as well get it. So I bought that. So yeah, um, and also uh, I got this this Dragon Ball. I got the Dragon Ball, and also inside it, uh, miniature figurines. Uh, uh, this uh, actually, if you get all, there's seven in total, as as you expect from Dragon Ball, but each one comes with like a miniature piece that. Combined to make uh, Shenlong the dragon, and inside I got um, 
Goku performing his uh, Kamehameha and I uh, got uh, Frieza. So yeah, I them two. And uh, actually, I got this this skill. Uh, the, the, this thing and the next thing I'm about to show you all came from the same store. So I like to thank um, Totally Nippon uh, for the stuff that they sold. So I give you guys a mention. So nice to see you guys. And this is the, probably the best thing I did buy. The best thing. Uh, this is a limited. This is a like. Uh, this is Mecha uh, Mecha Godzilla. Uh, the the Millennium series version, which uh, is as you know, as you can see, is is black. And and I and it um it cost me thirty five quid. It cost me thirty five quid to buy it, but it, it was a special edition, so it's definitely worth the money. And actually, um, it came with its tag. This is what you get. So this is uh, since they're 2002 uh, or 2003. Uh, yeah, I think 2003. Yeah, 2003 was um, uh, Godzilla Tokyo SOS. So yeah, but nevertheless, it's, it's, this, it's the it's the Millennium series um, Mecha Godzilla as black. So it, this is a special edition, basically, that they sell in Japan. That when it when it comes out, they do like special editions and uh, and I was reading, I was looking inside the um, the thing and I noticed uh, I've got some the I've got so now I've got uh, okay the mecha yeah I've got there's the silver one right there if you can just see but I've got the let's see if I can find it let's see if I can find it I've got the 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 King Ghidorah and the where is it ah uh, um. Uh, yeah, just right at the bottom there between uh, destroy and the angles. All right, well, but there's Rodan, but the next, one, the next, the one next to it is um, Godzilla's meltdown, which is the one I bought last year, along with Gador uh, last May when I bought with Ghidorah. So I'm looking forward to seeing. Uh, yeah, so th that's basically the best thing I bought at the expo. So, so yeah, like I uh, ended on my uh, Camcon thing. Uh, Hope you guys enjoyed this, and uh, and hopefully I can attend more expos in the future, as well as uh, the one in May. So yeah, bye.